had got this thing, the gonorrhea and HIV. All of them within a month, right? So boom, we was together for like five years. I do hair. So like I had all these motherfucking clients or whatever. For some reason, every time a client left, it was so fucking embarrassing because like they would always send me my nigga page and be like, yo, ain't this your boyfriend? Like why he in my DMs or whatever, blah, blah, blah. There's one girl, I knew she had chlamydia, like, and she was the bop. She was just like, like everybody rest. And she had gotten a ring in her throat. I basically like made her come over. I did her hair or whatever. And I already knew what she was he was gonna be on. So like boom. That shit got set up. Him and his homeboy though. They was both sitting on the couch and she bought both of them. So boom. So then I played it off or whatever. He wondered around why like I don't really wanna do nothing with him and stuff like that. And I'm just basically trying to say like I'm not really feeling too well. Like I think I got to the hospital or whatever. Like I just don't really feel like we need we need to be doing anything. So then a couple weeks went by. He told me he had to go to the hospital. And I'm just like, what's the matter? Like, are you okay with that? He's like, no, like, I'm cool. It's just like a regular physical type shit. He never tell me. Like, still to this day, he never confessed that he had fucking chlamydia. But like, I fucking know he had it. Like, so then, boom, time went on. Like, mind you, he never confessed it. And I never said anything either. So like, I just played it off. Another incident. This girl that I know, she, she used to do like recently and stuff with gay people. And like, no offense to gay people, but like, a lot of them do that each other. Long story short. <laughs> He was basically coming at her for like a couple years. It wasn't like he just hit her up out of the clear boot. Like he was on her ass. And I didn't ever want to tell him nothing because 